This is a quick, about one and a half minute look at the components of the Technodolly, the smart Technocrane. Here is the telescopic crane arm. In the column, we have the strong motors which are able to move the arm. And here in the base, we have the motor that moves the Technodolly on tracks. Now, let's move to the desk. The desk is where the cameraman controls the Technodolly. Let's have a closer look. There are two monitors. On the right monitor, you see the live picture. And on the left is where you will find your keyframes and your timeline. Pan and tilt is controlled with the joystick or the hand wheels. This is the focus wheel and the zoom rocker. The focus puller can also use the hand unit. The direct drive camera head comes complete with its own focus, zoom, and iris motors. The Technodolly comes with six pieces of track. Each track is three meters or about 10 feet in length. The Technodolly is a complete system. You need only a camera and a lens. How to make a camera move. There are two ways to make a move. You can either record a move live or program a move with keyframes. The Technodolly can be operated like a normal Technocrane. With the record button, the crane's movement can be recorded and then precisely repeated. We are now capturing this organic move of a live performance. To end the recording, simply press the same button. This move just created is now repeatable with precision. The monitor shows the first and last frame and the timeline of this recorded move. Now for designing moves, simple or complex, use keyframing. Move the camera to the first position and press the sample button. Move the camera to the last position and press the sample button. You now have a straight move from A to B. If we add more frames to this move, we have now created a curved move. There is no limit to the numbers of keyframes and the number of frames needed depends on the length and complexity of your move. How to tune a move. To extend the end of a move, we place the camera at our new ending position. The cameraman adjusts pan, tilt, focus, and zoom, then samples. This adds the additional keyframe. To extend the beginning of a move, we sample a keyframe before the first keyframe. If we want to adjust an existing frame, we travel to that keyframe make our corrections, and resample. This new keyframe replaces the old frame. Additional keyframes may be necessary to fine-tune the composition. Here, we sample a corrective keyframe, including focus, between frames. The Technodolly always calculates the smoothest camera path. Using the dwell, 
we can create a pause, which also changes a move to a straight path. For example, boom, straight down, pause, and a swing straight away. How to play a move. First, check that the programmed move is free of obstructions by traveling backwards through the path of the move. With this hand controller, the camera travels slow, fast, backward, or forward on the programmed path. Or by pushing the dead man switch, the cameraman with his rocker at the desk controls the movement. While looking on the monitor, the cameraman can follow the pace of the actor. The camera operator can be in control of the speed of the move by using the rocker. If during the move, the talent moves out of frame, like you see now, the camera operator using the joystick or hand wheels can override the programmed move live. The camera operator sets the length of the whole move or specifies the time between each keyframe. The go to command allows you to go directly to any keyframe of a move. By clicking on a frame, the Techno Dolly goes from wherever it is straight to the selected keyframe. When playing a move, the Techno Dolly is dependable due to its numerous safety features. Frame accurate. Repeat passes. One example of this effect is to show the same person twice in a shot. To achieve this, you need frame accurate, repeated camera moves. We call these passes. There are three rules that need to be followed. You can only start at the beginning or the end of a move. All passes must be started with the bloop plate. And the camera and the techno dolly must be synchronized using the shutter cable or genlock, which works at multiple frame rates. Stop motion. The Techno Dolly is the perfect tool for stop motion. Recorded or keyframed moves can shoot stop motion animation along with live action with dialogue. To achieve the desired effect, the camera movement is divided into single frame increments. Once stop motion mode is selected, pressing the hand rocker one time moves the camera one frame. Shooting live concerts and talk shows with the Techno Dolly. The Techno Dolly is the next generation of Techno Cranes. It is the world's first fully automated telescopic crane. Direct drive motors move the crane silently and safely. In all, nine axes control every aspect of the camera, giving the crew complete control over the dolly, crane, head, and lens. The most basic type of camera move travels directly between two positions. For more elaborate camera moves, we add more waypoints, or keyframes. The camera operator and grip are finding the best starting point and the best end point 
as well as necessary points in between for the camera move. At these key frames, they also set the focus and zoom. Now, they can travel on the path with the use of a simple rocker or with a set time between the keyframes. For a concert or a talk show of 100 minutes length, it is impractical to program 300 camera moves of 20 seconds each and then play them one after another. The director will want to call shots live during the program, but they must be prepared in advance. Technocrane developed the revolutionary matrix command as the solution. Start by composing the main shots for the show. For example, in this concert we chose the cello, violin, chorus, wind section, harp, and vocalist. With the matrix command, the Technodolly automatically generates 36 different camera moves between the six main keyframes. There is no limit to the number of keyframes that can be used. Four keyframes will generate 16 moves, or 12 will generate 144, for example. The cameraman and the grip now tune each of the 36 camera moves by composing with pan, tilt, and zoom. Focus can also be preset. The operator is also checking that the camera paths generated by the Technodolly do not interfere with the set pieces or musicians. The concert starts. The director calls the shots live to the Technodolly operator. From wherever the camera is, he has five moves ready to get to his next position. The grip ensures the safety of the camera move with a dead man switch. The camera is traveling from the violin to the harp. Upon arriving at the harp, the operator can select again from five new destinations. Now the operator chooses to go to the cello. After arriving there, new choices automatically appear on the screen. The operator can also stop on the path or go backwards. At any time, he can manually override the program if the musician changes his position.